niaje na tumai unaendelea fiti na hope yako imekuwa salama salmini niaje je Mr. Mola karibu sana kwa hizi mita sijai kwa na hapa leo umekaribia shukran sana kwa kupitia leo kama kawaida ni another sunday na huwa tuko na hizi sunday sessions hizi sunday discussions and tuko hapa for another one last week tulikuwa na an interesting one so nitafanya a weekend roundup i hope this will be brief if not sitakuwa surprised nimesema hivi mara kadhaa but tutafanya a weekend roundup kisha tutaangalia jinsi wiki pia ilivyokuwa since the last time tuko hapa on live which ilikuwa last sunday tukiwa na kakusha venetia na alifanya lively ilikuwa vibrant ali drop so many gems tips ideas na ilikuwa a beautiful session eje anasema swahili tu <laughs> Swahili so swahili so imefanya nini So last week tuanze na last weekend kwanza then tukuje all the way till this weekend Tuone kama leo tuta e compress na iko brief lakini hizi sessions as we've established by now tunakujanga na zinaenda up zimekuwa 2 hours long Tulikuwa na conversation kuhusu kuhusu music na nikisema kuhusu music ni it had to do with one what are you listening to you look at the first part of our discussion ku share kile tunasikiza which nimefikiria before ni jump on live nimefikiria kukuwa na a segment na a part of easy live sessions where tuna share music that tumekuwa tukisikiza and we can make that a ritual tunaweza ifanya tukimaliza show where kama uko hapa kama una watch unasema whatever you've been listening to na tuna recommend music to one another so if we can manage kuifanya we can get to that and tunaweza jaribu we can try kuanzia leo tukifika mwisho tuanze hiyo story ya recommendation na depending on mwenye atakuwa hapa hiyo time ikifika tutaona vile itaenda na nitaisema tena for those who will join us later and tuone kama tutaweza ifanya frequently and we'll have some parameters tutaona vile tutaifanya kama tutai make Kenyan or African ama global na international tutajua but we shall get to that so tukiongea na kakusha hapa wiki iliyopita tulikuwa tunazungumzia what are you listening to which ilianza our discussion ku share music that we've been listening to we've been enjoying na whatever has been on our playlist na ili fit vizuri sana kakusha ku join juu yeye una playlist and a youtube channel yake called keep it kenyan amekuwa kifanya for a few months now so ilikuwa fit that ali to join akatuambia kile amekuwa kisikiza na vile yeye unda playlist zake which pia ilikuwa another part of the conversation that to we'll get into playlisting na playlisting ikihusiana na the art of playlisting art ya kuunda playlist ku pick the songs that make it to playlist zake za kipit Kenyan vile yeye uzi arrange ideas ambazo yeye utumia ku ku structure the playlist themes and what not so ilikuwa intriguing kusikia toka kakusha na vile yeye unda playlist zake kipit Kenyan so kama hujui about it there you go kama uko interested in listening check kakusha out ukiangalia the last video on on up iv on ig the last one before this one utona hiyo discussion nimemtag kwa the caption unaweza mpata or if ni youtube tafuta kakusha venetia uta mpata uta get channel yake na utasikiza hizo playlists ameunda which you should be tuning into ni interesting ju tuna focus on kenyan music ni poa kuona that people are listening to Kenyan music na wanaunda playlist from Kenyan music that was a beautiful thing 
after that na story za playlisting tuliongelea cohesion kidogo cohesion cohesion kwa Kenyan projects kwa Kenyan albums mixtapes EPs ilikuwa something that imekaa kwa mind yangu for some time it still does whenever i'm listening to projects since i review projects every now and then ama almost every time si ongelea cohesion sana na vile a project in a move kutoka place moja hadi ingine how songs are sequenced how the entire project at the end of the day in a sound na vile imeandikwa and the themes that the artist amekuwa concerned with ini kitu si discuss si discuss sana katika review zetu ni kama ku bring your conversation hapa which i believe will have some other time hatukui hatuku expound sana ama hatukui exhaust completely so ni a discussion that we shall have once again tuongele cohesion jupia nime interact na wasani kadha whose projects nime review na wenye wameshare sentiments regarding the same na ningependa ku extend your discussion na to be for ground more to see more views na sentiments diverse kutoka other people on what they think as well as cohesion kwa projects na kwa the listeners experience so we discussed that alafu tuka get into music sustainability which ilikuwa a main part of our discussion last week sustainability ya the music industry sustainability ya art Kenyan music to be specific systems na structures zile ziko pale or lack thereof na kuangalia what can be done how can people move forward tunaezaje kuwa innovative na creative ili to come up na solutions ambazo ni sustainable for artists wa watu wa kuable ku support wa kuable ku ku make dreams zao zi come to fruition na whatever it is they are planning to do and achieve waweze kutimiza kupitia sana yao ilikuwa an engaging na insightful discussion do check that out check out our previous our previous IG live which really happened a week ago check it out ni muhimu sana iko na ideas kibao sana na vitu ambavyo tunafaa kufikiria ikikuja kwa sana yetu ikikuja kwa industry yetu and kisha tukazungumzia we went back to music tukimaliza kuongelea because tuligusia alia tukianza kwa hiyo live when we were talking about music na what we are listening to tuliongelea sauti soul and their solo projects which i shared that snippet on youtube alafu later pia tukimaliza tuligusia tena ku sum up the conversation kuongelea what we expect kutoka EP ya BNA Me Baraza na Aaron Rimbui imetoka bado sijaisikiza iko part of the projects that I'm supposed to listen to in this coming two weeks na kuna kazi mom za kusikiza which is something I wanted us to touch upon kuna tumongelea too much music two or three weeks ago lakini in november in november itself iko na already so much music na hiyo ya bien na aron tuligusia last week jinsi nime mention tukipea na our expectations kuhusu how it a sound ama themes and basically what we expect from the project we, we shall revisit your discussion na kakusha tuone how the ep is na whether tulikuwa accurate sijaisikiza bado but nimesema iko part of the projects that i am supposed to listen to sijui kama umeisikiza usinipatie spoilers lakini but you can tell me kama umeisikiza and i will get to it but kuna number of projects that i'm supposed to get to i'll also talk about 
why this is why i'm mentioning this you tumeto katuko review projects kibao sana this morning <laughs> leo subuhi tumekuwa na reviews na tume review projects mob and this coming two weeks kuna project pia zimetoka na zilitoka i think at the tail end of october or september but october october mostly zile nili hata na sikuwa na jua about alafu now november that zinatoka and <laughs> mwaka inaisha tunafaa kuunda our, our list sai i think nilitaja was it last week or the previous week that around the time publications wa wanaanza ku compile lists zao za the projects of the year we are also planning kufanya the same and with these projects zina toka that will be it will be difficult as far as kuzi review na kuzi eh yeah, kuzi review kuzi review do we are planning to have one more shoot ya ku review projects and then one more ya ku ndaizo list za humwaka eh so tuna vile kutaenda but ni kazi mob shall shall we, we can touch on that father but die so after hayo mazungumzo yetu wiki iliyopita na kakusha during the week as ikikuja kwa kwa youtube was the same thing we posted this week oh yeah these snippets snippets za our conversation na kakusha nilisha snippet moja tukiongelea projects za sauti soul individually and our expectations ama what we think the EPs will sound like kisha nika share another snippet kuhusu bald men love better EP ya BN na Arondi Mbui which is the first one that is coming out of the group alafu somewhere katikati ya wiki nika share the albums and the projects the Kenyan projects zile nilisikiza in October quite a number as usual quite a number na vile nimesema november since kuna other projects zile zimetoka na kuna other projects that niaje a nimehata za october najua nikishare list ya projects nimesikiza next month za this month itakuwa na projects kibao but nilishare whatever i listened to and i even i even did polls kuliza watu kama zisikiza zilikuwa intriguing hizo results kuna what people have listened to na what they've not listened to so utapata kuna artists whom sikuwa surprised ju najua si watu wenye wako na fan base kubwa ama hawajulikani sana and so watching his results you could were as surprised for some of them and then wale wenye una expect their names are more known than other artists you figure that kutakuwa na people who've listened to their projects for instance mtukai ebe nadhani ali sema lisikiza was it majira ya iv alexander and not kevoki was it kev not kevoki was there there is uh, there was majira and oh, and i think and, and kalenjin yeah kemboy i believe i believe i believe eh uh, i'm sure ni hizo and then kuna other projects that other people komiskiza but kuna hizo projects zenye naweza sema ziko kwa periphery ama zina exist in an unknown space ju au wasani si wasani ambao wanajulikana or una julikana na watu wengi as compared to others when you nilikuwa na share about so nika share hizo lists za whatever i listened to in october kisha here we are jana as uh, the weekend ilikuwa inakamilika jana kulikuwa na events kadha kulikuwa na events kadha jana i knew kulikuwa na first saturday at kuona trust kulikuwa na 
Usually in the Rumble in the Jungle, yeah, the remake movement. Ni aje Alexa, kulikuwa na Rumble in the Jungle, ya the remake movement. Alafu kulikuwa na Dreams of Tomorrow, album launch. Ya Lexas mshairi, at KNT, Rumble in the Jungle, ilikuwa, ili happen wapi, I, I, I saw ni kama wali change the venue Initially liku, initially liku I happen at Misitu Raha at his ranch Ah, current village, current village Yeah, current village And then vijan mesema, Dreams are Tomorrow Ya Alexa's Mshairi, album launch yake Ili happen at KNT Wee ebu liku wapi, Jana, where did you spend your day? Grieving over a football match, eh? ilikuwa exciting na ilikuwa an amazing thing to hang around na watu na kuona the community the artist community the art community waki hang pamoja it's always an amazing energy going around watu waki commune waki have conversations na watu waki commune kusikiza art na ku consume works of art that's always a, a, a good thing alafu since events peers ya kuwa there for a while this is events zinaanza kukuja na ku happen zina allow watu kupatana na watu ku spend some time together and and then anakumbuka hata earlier today nilikuwa na video ya yes, sijuku kulikuwa na event gani pia once again e to weekend where watu walikuwa wame chrome watu walikuwa wamejazana <laughs> and kulikuwa na a concert mahali na na look at nasema how stories are za covid na, and how the cases in as a spike once again maybe in a month or so but we shall see that once we get there so out of his events zote nilikuwa kwa dreams of tomorrow ya lexas at knt ilikuwa pale kumbi mdogo amazing vile nimesema in terms of the energy watu ku hang pamoja watu ku commune kusikiza art and it's also it's also amazing to Lexas ni a young artist who's started being active kwa career yake just recently miaka kadha iliyopita na kumuona ame take his strides during your time period na kumuona ana drop an album na ali launch an album ni a huge leap na ni kitu kubwa sana kwa career yake na kuna the amount of love na appreciation alipata from the audience na mashabiki wake supporters wenye walikuja show watu wenye wali travel from home county yake Machakos kuja kumuona place alianzia career yake ilikuwa beautiful na kuna that kind of support system ni kitu fiti sana which ties into what we spoke about last week kuhusu building systems za wasanii na structures na building your fan base na kutafuta people who will pay for your show people who will pay for your exclusive content <coughs> hint hint <laughs> nudge nudge <laughs> watu wenye watalipia content yako watu wenye wata show up wa kusikize and they are willing ku travel wako willing to spend time yao na wewe ilikuwa amazing and hizo ndizo vitu wasanii wana look forward to na wana seek kutimiza ikikuja kwa career zao and ilikuwa so after the show nilikuwa naambia Mosoti if we if ingekuwa a concert format whereby kuna performances kuna sets alafu after after these sets Niaje Lone Wolf thank you so much for being here it's the first time that Lone Wolf is joining us shukran sana for being here if ingekuwa a concert format and the show had artists who are performing lengthy sets alafu kuna breaks za music where the DJ is playing that would have been possible for us kutoka nje ya ukumbi mdogo alafu tungekaa na to have conversations about the show na to review the show while at the venue which we did for Yabas Hekaya Zarumba Ken in September and we review 
we reviewed the show had discussions kuhusu and the video is on our youtube channel ilikuwa an interesting format ya kuifanya so if 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 you watched it ama you want you would like to watch it you watch alafu to be what you think about your format because nilikuwa nataka kuona feedback na nijue if it's something you would love to watch more of tungeifanya jana but because of how the what the artists were coming one after the other poetry alafu kuna singers ilikuwa hard kuweza kutoka na kufanya hivyo and then since it's a concept show once maybe if you miss something unaweza hata the flow of thought and the format na how the show in a flow and the structuring ni kitu tume discuss before on he live sessions on his live sessions ikikuja kwa how to structure shows how to conceptualize shows how to arrange them na kuziorganize jinsi ya kuzicurate which ni a critical part of any show of any event we would have discussed all of these aspects siki tuniko siko willing to fly for for this live e we want to just do a round up na like a summary format of the entire week so how to delve into it as much considerably siji kama tutakwebul kuifanya i do i do doubt though ju the next time we are meeting kufanya our reviews ni me mention to kianza we have maybe one more shoot for project kenyan project reviews ju ni mesema kuna kazi mob na kuna kazi zimetoka in october that tulihata alafu kuna kazi zinatoka in november and we'll get a chance ya kuzi review maybe in two weeks time tumekuwa na reviews leo ngoware so maybe after two weeks to review other projects and then we'll have one more shoot ya kuongelea our top projects of the year i am excited about his list i am excited about your list and so you come we can we can <sighs> hmm i don't know if you can do that show live it can be hard kufanya a show live because we usually record in the wee hours of the morning we can still do it actually we can we, we can still do it na tuifanye hiyo 1 am or 2 am because we don't care time utai watch utai watch but hiyo show ya our top lists our top projects of this year should be interesting niko excited hata kuunda my list nimekuwa my list nimekuwa nikizifikiria sana kwa kichwa na kuzi piece together i cannot wait to see what we shall come up with na what kila individual atakuwa nayo kwa list zake top eps of the year top albums of the year i am really waiting and nasema tuifanye live ju i want you to be part of it na u share pia list yako if you do have one we established up a few weeks ago that nyinyi hamskizi kenyan projects hamskizi kenyan projects we established that <laughs> a few weeks back a few weeks back for a live that to li answer was it at 10 pm or 11 pm to kind of all the way had one something am i do not know if you have been listening to kenyan projects as much from waka if you have please look out for that na pia kuna videos that tulifanya media June July tulizi release in July na zilikuwa lists za top 5 top 5 EPs top 5 albums top 5 hip hop projects of 2021 so check out his media lists as well on YouTube ni interesting ni interesting so nangoja sana kuna what we come up with na ningependa kuwe part of your show kama tutaifanya cause kufanya show live uko na technical technical processes na technical barriers ama technical aspects nyingi so sijui kama tutaweza if not tunaweza ifanya on IG after hiyo shoot when we come here that evening sauti za mabinti niaje after hiyo shoot ya our top 10 lists of the year that sunday that could be our discussion so as early as now pia wewe na ku challenge start having lists of the projects that umesikiza humu waka kenyan that you've enjoyed and that would make 
your top 5 or top 10 ep ep's albums na na hip hop projects so eba na sema yes please more honest show za video reviews thank you thank you eb thank you eb we shall eh yeah, it's it's ilikuwa concept intriguing kuifanya and i am willing kuifanya tena for more and more events niko willing kuifanya tena so if if that's something that you love to to watch niko more than willing kuifanya then eb pia nasema ako in the niko in the process of planning a show unajua time nimesema hiyo idea ya show na ku curate nimekufikiria cause ultembo na panga show niko in the process of planning a show and man it's overwhelming it is it's difficult it's almost or iko kwa hiyo same category of projects and as my vision na nikumbusha a discussion that we had yesterday night after event imeisha your dreams are tomorrow alexa at kent tuko tunaongelea ku msanii flani alikuwa anatuambia how they, they want to release a project and your mental process and how taxing it is ukifikiria jinsi jinsi itatoka vile utaimaliza when you time market how it was received and even show your lexas itself which nilikuwa naongelea encapsulates that too amekuwa kishughulikia hii project for 2 to 3 years recording back and forth featuring artists and process ya ku record hadi ufike ile point tunasema i am good and we are done tuko sawa let's now mix the project hiyo ni kazi nyingi sana going back and forth with your writing with your editing and recording it's an intense process alafu after that ufikiria maybe kupanga a show ya ku launch now planning a show <laughs> planning a show is an entirely different ball game and intense nani hectic nani inundating vile eba nasema so eb na ku understand entirely ni aje karim junajua kupanga show huwa tricky and curating it pia ni another aspect enye tuliongelea besides kuongelea project releases kwa hiyo discussion ime mention tulisema how kupata a show which is one thing tunge discuss if tunge review show alexas ama tunge visual conversations during the show if you want to get a show where everything is deliberate na killer piece of the whole is a critical piece na ni kitu important ndio show yako iwe successful na ile concept unawakia ikuwe catered for to the letter in as a get tricky and you need aspect ya curation na tumeongelea shows a number of times kwa easy live sessions inaweza kuwa hard it also is premised on featured acts when unakuwa nao wasani wenye wanafaa kuku kuku openia wenye una perform now wenye wanakuja after you easy moving parts zote ziko tied together and una inafa kukuwa that everything ina make sense at the end of the day na kila ile set out to achieve ka objective yako kama goal yako show ikikamilika msana fa kwa able kusema hivi ndio tume feel na wewe kama msanii hata kwanza na wewe useme objective ilikuwa kitu fulani lengo lilikuwa hili na tumelitimiza vile show imekamilika so ku curate show ku organize show inaweza get tricky hizi aspect tungezi discuss ju one another aspect ni the music being played so if you have a show and tuliongelea when we reviewed hekaya za rumba ken show ni kuhusu rumba ken lakini uko na hizi interludes za dj na anacheza reggae and it has nothing to do with the idea ya rumba ken it doesn't tie into the overall concept of the show na the objective similarly with issue ya spoken word na poetry uko na interludes where kuna songs being played zenye have nothing to do with the mood of the show now with the idea of the show hizo ni vitu zile you have to be 
deliberate na intentional about kuongea na MC kuongea na DJ kuambia hivi ndio vile mnafaa kufanya hii ndio energy tuna go for hii ndio mood tunafaa kuset and setting that intentionally from the word go watu pia wakiingia na wakiwa part of it waweze tell alafu mnawa direct hata hivyo with the word choices with the actions that mnafanya kufanya kila kitu as much as you possibly can ili mkuebol ku achieve agenda yenu when the show imeisha is in a number of aspects that tungegusia and that we were talking about after the show briefly na musoti na pia other people kuhusu kuhusu the show hiyo aspect ya mziki another thing that nilikuwa nafikiria featuring acts can be tricky na hectic pia the number when sure haiko conflated na uko na so many acts and ku keep it minimalist and ku ensure that kuna precision sometimes including watu wengi inaweza kuwa difficult to achieve one thing that really appreciate na show Alexas ilikuwa the fact that artist wali fit into your idea ya dreams za tomorrow na nilikuwa naambia Roger hivi alia besides your idea ya personal dreams personal ambition and the drive na ku try ku reach goals flani in life as far as art iko concerned na dreams zake za sanaa amongst other creatives kuna another layer here because easy dreams the only way unaweza zi achieve na goals zako as you feasible ni if kuna a conducive environment na a conducive state of things that makes it possible for where kuifanya and inaweza kuwa what ni mentioned a few moments ago that we discussed last week systems na institutions creatively ama marketing wise ama branding wise entrepreneurial etc or the same systems na institutions na structures zinaweza kuwa governmental na zinaweza kuwa political ju the political system system ya leadership na governance ina tie into dreams za wasani ina tie into the dreams of the populace in general so ziko intertwined and hiyo ilikuwa another layer that people addressed kwa their pieces na kwa their songs ideas are dreams dreams are sana alafu personal na individual dreams za different people and then dreams za Kenyans in general na vile wamekuwa oppressed na wamekuwa suppressed by the government for ages and how that ties into the overall consciousness of the people alafu the overall ideal of the people na goals za the nation in its entirety if it was really brought out for the show and that was a plus that kulikuwa na hiyo intention and you could tell ilikuwa deliberate kuhusu hiyo idea ya dreams za tomorrow ah nimewapatia 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 tidbits hapa na pale kuhusu the show and how it was tunge 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 delve into into more if 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 we were discussing the show as a whole for for this session So that happened Jana Gioni Kisha leo asubuhi tuki as as tuki round up this thing leo asubuhi tumefanya reviews tumefanya reviews mm-hmm. tume review kazi nyingi sana and nikianza or at some point during the live nimeongelea story of music na how we've talked about too much music it's always recurring you that's what we usually discuss but nilikuwa nasema how for november as of leo ni 7th but kuna two projects zile na jua ep zote that sijaskiza na hiyo <laughs> ni kazi right october 
kuna reviews ama kuna projects that i know nili miss last week tukiwa hapa nakakusha in fact ni yali niambia sana ipay ako na an ep which i had no information about <laughs> now hizo ni 2 november and then sana ipay 3 i just saw artwork ya calligraph uh, al- album yake an album invisible currency i saw that last a few days ago that's an album and nyone kana ngoma ka 18 mse ah 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 Oh. Hey, see 18 songs. Too many songs. Too many songs. Too too many songs. And 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 you know Eb 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 na Karim, you can mona ya hizo hizo posters, hizo artwork, posts za calligraph. Are you looking forward to the album? So you come in a drop. I have a feeling enough I could drop soon. And it's about it's about time. Yeah, it's about two it's it's almost about that time. Mliona. Go kuna reflection so ah. Eb 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 umeni preempt umeni preempt yani au mimi preempt mbaya sana mbaya sana mbaya so kuna kuna reflection hapa but mm. that's the artwork eh your reflection your ring light no can but that's the that's the artwork Eh, na ni ni madollars ni madollars so nasema eb ameni preempt ju eb eb amesema based on the artwork nope <laughs> mm. <laughs> ah eb 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 unajua tukiongelea tukiongelea lyrics na layered writing hiyo discussion na kumbuka nilisema tunafaa kuongelea artwork unakumbuka nilisema tunafaa ku get a session either on IG live ama nitafute nitafute the crew na tuongelee artworks you it's something that has been on my mind for a while Kari mona sema niliona niliona cover niliona cover na kuna collab na Dax. Ah kuna ngoma na Dax. I didn't I, I just skimmed through and best of my memory nakumbuka I think niliona ska Sikumbuki mm, let me see Sikumbuki any other features but titles za the songs how we do it ni na kitu kama hiyo. I think kuna a song that he took out already that I saw there najaribu kukumbuka just based of my memory before ni niangalie the artwork and now the songs from another thing that nimeongelea a number of times hapa na tumezi discuss kwa reviews zetu even hata leo asubuhi tuki review tumeongelea artwork tumeongelea song titles ni best of a song title unaweza jua what to expect from an artist unaweza jua so nili nili niliona hivi eh eba nasema ni hiti tuongelee artwork itabidi 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 sana so aya 17 songs and as karima ametuambia 
na na hiyo ngoma na Dax ni song number 16 naitwa Hiroshima featuring Dax. Hmm. Yeah, I got a feature Dax. You know, that's big, that's big. Hmm. So, ngoma yeye imetoka that what did I see? I was wrong. I was wrong actually. Nilikuwa nadhani kuna song that imetoka that I saw kwa list. So hakuna. You see, also it's I I I don't know about you, but who and I find na I find So you come it. You come it takes away to me sometimes it does. Nikionanga an album ama a project and then the title of the project and then kwa the track list kuna a title track some sometimes there is something that it does kwa mind yangu so that happens kwa my process ya listening so you come it's the same for you however if title tracks are done and executed properly that's a plus that's a plus like ni sometimes na kuanga mm okay you i usually appreciate it sana if hakuna a song that is titled after the project yani ni wewe as a listener ujaribu ku ku figure out where that is going that so you kwa something that more appreciate lakini kuna some title tracks that have had kwa albums za humwaka that ni may appreciate naweza sema Juliani na masterpiece Jack Muguna na Journey of the Soul Michel Gatui kuna Sky Up Above Karun na Kacha Vibe they all had title tracks na nimezi appreciate lakini kuna kuna hiyo mystery ya yenye ni intriguing usipoweka a song titled usipoweka a title track now the point is this i'm about to extend your discussion the, the opening song kwa hii album ni the title track that song number one. ukisikiza si you done the album mama If that song number one, ukisikiza simemalizana. <laughs> you kila nasema and even adding on to my points earlier, title tracks give away the piece. Right? Cuz you and your foundation, your piece. And I I feel that this is the case here. Alafu najua I know what this will be. I already know what this will be. If we do review this project, Eb na Karim mtazi watch na mta bear witness. Na kama una watch this after the fact, utani bear witness. I know this is a compilation project. Ikikuja kwa the flow of thought. Alafu najua idea ya invisible currency haitakuwa expounded on to the T. take my word for it if we review it to revisit na tutakati we shall crop this segment of the video na to have your discussion kuhusu hii project hizo ni your thoughts nilikuwa nazo the moment i saw the artwork niko na the track list and skim through hizo ni your thoughts nilikuwa nazo now eba na sema honestly i'm not expecting much from this based on one the artist <laughs> two album title three songs and the 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 the, 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 the picture for the background ni dollars i don't know karim anasema yap hiyo ni big win hiyo ilikuwa in relation to your collaborator dax unaona ani nili scheme ada skuona jini peter then Eben has a big win for Dax not Jones. <laughs> What do you mean? Dax is huge. Dax is huge. 
Karimu nasema tujivunie ukenya. Missy Patriot, Missy Patriot. Halafu Eba alijitetea hapa last tricks ago akisema yesi mkenya. Kwa kwa when 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 tulisema watu wataje Kenyan artist Eba akasema yesi mkenya. So Karim mwanze hapo kwa peke yako. Eba nasema this is why I'm I'm not for releasing song lists and features before the album drops. This is interesting. One thing before ni maliza comment ya Abe, one thing that I've noticed artists are doing more recently ni not having features kwa the titles of the songs ukisikiza on streaming sites. Utadhani msanii yako peke yake, alafu unasikia njambia. Wait, huyu ni nani amefi ako featured hapa? Oh, ingo iko na nani? And I, I I can't remember whom i saw talking about the same lakini the idea ni if you have features na msea one msani fulani maybe hiyo ndio there's a way it, it, it forms perceptions kwa brain ya a listener ama msia ko interested and then listening process na experience inaanza kuwa affected at that point in time so what happens niki nikiona and i, I Listen, listen. This is happening in real time. Kuna comment naona hapa na inasema umse anasema anangoja 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 kuanza na ngoma yenye iko na ska na yenye iko na zinia. <laughs> Literally. I am saying this Jew which which is fine. Eb, eb pia kuna time alituambia kuhusu process yake ya listening na akisema ata skim through alafu atasikiza songs si in the order necessarily but kupata a feel of the album or of a project ndio ajue kaa atasikiza ni aje hazel that's fine watu kuwa na processes tofauti tume review a project this morning na nilikuwa naambia Roger cuz ilimshinda kusikiza but nilikuwa namwambia kile ungejaribu kufanya ni kushuffle the project uone how that would have been for you nimekuwa nikishuffle project this year not on the first listen though afterwards after nimesikiza and if it's a project i love i'll, I'll do that when i a different experience na nilisema i've been trying listening to projects differently that's one thing nimekuwa niki experiment on kusikiza projects on shuffle especially ka nazipenda so nilikuwa namwambia ungejaribu hivyo uone if ungepata something that would have made you listen to the album abe alisema vile usikiza pia projects so process ya kusikiza haina haina issue unaweza na the last song unaweza kuna watu i'm sure who prefer albums and projects having title tracks and they will therefore maybe even start with the title track apa hivi tomorrow it's the first one kwa the album but the point ni kuna certain processes that are that are, that are happening ukiona hiyo list alafu there is a way in which it affect your experience it's an interesting idea ya mtu kukuwa na a project lakini hawoni any features and easy for the artwork because the artwork is different artwork ni different but ukienda kwa a streaming site na unataka kusikiza hii project hawoni any features so you think new yum sani peke yake alafu as you listen kuna hiyo surprise factor that oh ingoma iko na ebe oh hazel is singing here oh karima kuna a verse kwa ingoma kitu kama hiyo na ni intriguing so now it changes how unaisikiza but that's an interesting idea nyan ni kuna sema ya kutokuwa na, na features which ebe alikuwa anasema aki emphasize idea yake ya kuto release song list and then i mean people already make assumptions yes yes and it affects how i listen to the album exactly kile ni mensema hata before ni malize the sentiment alafu e bana sema it's pretty obvious ni compilation album <laughs> yes indeed
Also, I get why he'd have 18 songs on the album. Most big artists on like a lots of songs to boost streams and songs for chats. Definitely, definitely. To discuss the story of a while back, wasani ku eka many songs because of the idea of streams na kujaribu ku raise the streams alafu ku kuwa na songs that will fit kwa different charts songs that will fit kwa different playlists which will increase streams eventually na possibly the revenue yenye wata earn upie ni aja upi samahani ni aja so nilikuwa nataka tu 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 pitia hii list alafu we can move on to something else to maliza hii story so invisible currency song number 1 all i need all i need all i need it could be story of success na do or it could be a love song we shall have we shall, we shall clip easy parts easy segments so nataka tulikuwa accurate last week tulifanya for bald men love better kwa uko hapa na umeisikiza usinipatie spoilers but just let me know kama umeisikiza or not Tuliongelea na Kakusha last week na tukapea na expectations. Ike chuku. Rada safi. <laughs> Ateri dala featuring Prince Inda. Na kupeleka home. A love song possibly, a love song. I'm on the move featuring Blackway. And then and then Abe, you can only notice no na naona sai. Kitu ni notice kwanza ilikuwa spacing between the number and the title hakuna space so as i'm reading this no na i'm on the move imeandikwa am on the move he haya haya and then pia punctuation ya the song titles wali zifanya poorly the punctuation ziko wrong so and then so you, i don't know if anyone counter checked it. it it feels as if no one did because now the the titling na si ati ni consistent you are consistent ninge some maybe it's stylistic but si consistent so ateri dala the a is capital d is capital ada safi r capital s ni small all i need a na i capital n ni ndogo invisible currency i capital c ni ndogo so si consistent you know kile na manisha I'm also teaching myself and I'm learning this over and over again. We've spoken about this for reviews all the time. Stop overthinking. <laughs> I have to tell myself that stop overthinking. <laughs> Which we always do on our channel. Ah yeah. Mombi ya mama featuring Adasa. Kamnyueso featuring Major. Ah yeah. Ah yeah. Direction, direction wanguvu featuring alikiba direction inner peace featuring kev the topic after that tsunami featuring ska you can tell you can tell tsunami is a braggadocious song hata hata usiende mbali you can tell from the title how we do featuring zinia manase how we do you know nilikuwa nasema earlier how we do it <laughs> how we do it nilikuwa nasema earlier kumeni how we do featuring zinia manase from the title unajua you know na ndio nilikuwa nasema title za songs can tell you what to expect eh besides artwork i think on that same day to kiavio shoot tutaongelea song titles and how rudimentary our song titles usually are be my guest Ride for you root boy a love song and they had a collab on a root boy kwa cock studio is it w- is this the song ride for you acha ni confirm acha ni confirm calligraph jones na root boy na hiyo ilikuwa inaitwa tonight ilikuwa inaitwa tonight na ilikuwa hizi ngoma za club banger kind of songs ngoma za ku have fun 
and Ride for You seems like a love song similar to Ateri Dala similar to mm, Izo alafu kuna hizi songs zile zitakuwa braggadocious and we know this I feel invisible currency will be that the the title invisible currency sounds intriguing the title and if the cover could have been better and more artistic it could have picked interest na inge inge spark an interest like as far as this unaweza tell kwenye nielekea but invisible currency as a title na i find intriguing to some level but kuna braggadocious songs which it also do na conquest as far as rap na ambitions and then maybe ngomaka in a piece in a sound kidogo introspective na maombia mama and calligraph amekuwa proud na open kusu love yake for his mother and and then support ya madhake and then so ride for you featuring rude boy bad dreams Mm, curious to hear that bad dreams flee flee mm, i don't know what whoever is whoever is fleeing is fleeing from bad dreams then flee and then hero ni mwanao jina hiyo hiroshima featuring ducks i'm presuming it akwa socio political based on the title alafu based on what ducks raps about na ngoma zake and how who wanna see approach Hiroshima and then after that need the Kali Chronicles and i feel as if the Kali Chronicles itakuwa kama testimony 1990 the title track the title track testimony 1990 hiyo dia ya chronicles zake za life experiences that mipitia and how amefika to place amefikia as a closer of the album we shall revisit the conversation na tuone how wrong we were or how accurate we were e bana sema i'm more interested to see what he does musically ah ha 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 ev 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 hazel to don't get a hip hop Nona tu uko pale kwa audience. Shukran sana, shukran sana. <laughs> I hope it's not rap hook rap hook. Eb 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 eb. Eb. <laughs> That's ni kuita mara ngapi? Kali mwana sema hapo ni do all I need. Mimi nataka do. Mhm. Which song number 2? Ha, ya tuta tuna if if Kali malikuwa right tutaona. Nataka hiyo do nega do nega do nega <laughs> eh pa unasema ni pa karimu anasema hiyo ni sequel Ndio anasema mimi nataka kusikia ya ducks mm okay Scar na Dasa huyo demo kwa na sauti poa mhm hizo ndizo ana look forward to ama amesema hiyo ya ducks ndio anakamika comment eh amesema looking forward eh with hiyo discussion we should have that to me yongele a number of times song titles we can cement it even further for a specific conversation for that and that alone just as the comment i read na nikiongele listening behaviors na habits eba na sema sky ta kwa the first listen so pia yeye ataanza tu atafungua album hivi aende kwa song number 11 tsunami usikia watu wa showcase rapping skills ku take over the game ku swipe over the game na the industry alafu hiyo collab ya dark i feel it akwa showcase of machine gun rapping mm mm-hmm. oh, no. for, for me the, the title inanipeleka to a different state Hiroshima Tutangoja tuone how accurate is the sentiments zilikuwa once the album itatoka tuta revisit So tumalize by projects that we reviewed I to make up for an hour <laughs> This was this was supposed to be short 
so he said at the beginning. Let's talk about the projects that we may review earlier this morning and nimesema how what up our skizangi Kenyan projects. Sasa sijui kama mtachangia kwa haya mazungumzo but to review we, we reviewed eight projects this morning eight projects the whole morning na nikisema ng morning ni kuanzia 2 am 2 am at 7:30 am or 7 am ndio maana nimesema ningetaka tufanye our list together za our best projects of the year kwa a live stream but your live stream itakuwa hiyo 2 am <laughs> ama 3 am <laughs> ndio maana nimesema tunaweza ifanya hapa hivi on instagram hiyo hiyo sunday na watu waanze kufikiria list zao so tume review some of these projects i asked you kama mmesikiza na niongelea selections zile ab alimen alisema alisikiza majira na kalenjini ya kemboy so majira is one of those that to review by iv alexander i want to work on editing them this week and releasing them so iv alexander's majira is forthcoming so ab look forward to that to review kalenjini by kemboy Abe also look forward to that. Kimboy had to join up last week. IV Alexander's Majira ni an EP, Kalenji ni an album. Both of these are debuts for the artist. To review Lost in Motion by Jacquel. So for more album ya Jacquel. To review Sichangi's project album ya Sichangi. Eba mshuko kwa familia na Sichangi. Sijui kwa umesikiza album yake though. To me review if you have look forward to that. Is any four. The fifth that to me review ni Victoria Kimani. Karim sijui kwa umesikia Victoria Kimani. Hazel sijui kwa umesikia Victoria Kimani. Eb sijui kwa umesikia Victoria Kimani. Sijui kama ako kwa your palette to me review spirit animal fourth project yake her second full length lp if you have look forward to that too if you haven't you can consider listening to these projects you can consider listening to them alafu u look forward to the review ili u ukue na your own sentiments alafu usikize what we thought about the projects so that was the fifth Victoria Kimani the the sixth was Noel Deritu Noel Deritu's second full length but in total fifth project yake in Aitwa City on a Hill an album to my review alafu seventh ilikuwa Domani Munga exposed Domani wa Wakadinali so for more project yake an album exposed Munga's revenge to me review that should be forthcoming look forward to that alafu the eighth ni anaware ya Matata and Benso and Nviri the storyteller is only the eight projects that we've been listening to recently now that to me review and i should be reviewing the videos i should be editing the reviews he wiki hopefully we start getting them from your wiki ngine or possibly towards the end of this week ama from midweek kama ntamaliza kuzi edit <laughs> out of all those projects Abel Jamani's here Majira na Kalenjin Hazel na Karim which of those have you listened to which of those have you listened to
Karimu lisa mulisikia exposed kwa the kwa the polls that I asked on Instagram. I think wewe oh, ulisa mulisikia number 9 drill ya Kevo Kefos. And you can ask what you thought about that project and how many times have you listened to it. But out of these projects gani umesikiza? Look for look forward to those reviews. Look forward to them. They'll be dropping hivi karibuni. I just need to edit na nizi release. And that has been a weekly roundup ah uh, ah uh, eba lesema amesikia pia domani ya munga pia nimesikia the review is forthcoming basi my brother review na kuja kazi kazi tushafanya kazi tushafanya review ndio inakuja hivi karibuni and to tutamalizia the year in two weeks time and stay with me kwa kwa hapa ni share an idea with you for easy lives tukimaliza in a few so the the nilikuwa nasema earlier that kuna so much projects that had a review ama kuna so much music that no one inatoka hii mwezi most likely so kuna two projects that najua that zimetoka e past week moja ni your bald men love better we discussed last week na kakusha alafu kuna up, is it what is it called the upset ama upset the upset ya ya brandy minor alafu kuna ya sanai pay tande which nilijua via kakusha those are three i haven't listened to i should be getting to them this week i made it editing as well this week and the following week as we plan our last shoot for reviews according to kile tumepanga and how we are envisioning this now kuna hii ya calligraph invisible currency anja <laughs> album zikiwa refu hivi eh kusisikiza get tricky <laughs> get tricky but kuna hii that's the fourth The day before the next shoot according to the plan MDQ should be dropping an album MDQ should be dropping an album io io i am looking forward to io i am looking forward to MDQ's last album ilikuwa she ya 2019 ningewaonesha kuna time wanted to show you a poster hapa and a gift ama a, a postcard ya MDQ ya she kiongelea wasanii ku kuwa na idea za ku connect with their fans and audiences cause kuna time to lit chill na MDQ akatupatia a few things ningeonesha but haiko hapa she was an amazing project na ngoja kuona what she does with her new project so your day before our last recording for the year MDQ is dropping an album your friday those are five hiyo itakuwa hard kuifanya cuz natoka hiyo day unless tufanye a fast listen review ama a reaction and b- before now and then najua najua kuna project zinatoka kibao sana so but we shall see we shall see how that one how that one goes na vile ita transpire nimewaambia what we've reviewed i hope you're looking forward to them kama umezisikiza unaweza consider kuzisikiza alafu uzi check out once the reviews zime drop pale kwenye channel at uh, sana kwa sana on youtube i want us to discuss something about reviews but we shall do that for another live ili kwa idea ndio kwa nafikiria to discuss leo but i have badai leo tume tume round up to now the idea ni kwa nasema nataka tu zungumzie tukimaliza ni nili nilisema tukianza nikiwa hapa na Jairus I think nataka nataka for instance now now <laughs> at this point kwa iri, kwa at kwa review kwa hii live nataka tuanze a ritual ya kushare music na kupea na recommendations at the end of killer live 
thumbs up ama finya yo finya yo yo like button ama useme ama unisha thumbs up kwa comments if you are in thumbs up kwa comments if you are in the idea ni wants to me have busy discussions tukifika mwisho whoever is still here to pane recommendations za mziki ya kusikiza so inaweza kuwa sijafikiria ti deeply i'm thinking as i'm speaking about it inaweza kuwa you share an album inaweza kuwa you share an ep that you would want to recommend that maybe umesikia hiyo wiki hey thank you for the for the hearts thank you for the hearts na eba merusha thumbs up inaweza kuwa something you've come across inaweza kuwa something you just want people to listen to it could be a song inaweza kuwa literally anything na haina of course hakuna timelines at year this year or whatever kuna timelines it's a recommendation so ningetaka to pen recommendations za mziki shukran karim for the thumbs up towards the end I'm literally at the end of his live sessions karim ebna na na hazel you you are musical individuals and you need fans wa mziki i i will since ni ndo mko hapa na nyinyi ndio your part of the foundation and the formation of this idea i let you decide i let you decide do we do we that's how do we constrain it to kenyan music ndio you could force us kiza muziki na toa hiyo pacha ku force kusikiza muziki na imeonta your perception i know but do we <laughs> focus on kenyan music or do we do it generally all across the globe vile pia ni may phrase ina alter your perception <laughs> unajua kuna way phrasing of questions determines how you'll answer them it's a it's a thing you learn kwa kwa sciences whether in social sciences or sciences mostly social sciences when you need frame it a time in sense ita kwa and it a kwa responded to but do we do we do we as a mk97 tuifanye kenyan ama tuifanye kote kote abe karib na hazel niambieni eba nasema itakuwa lil baby weekly hadi kwa fan <laughs> think from from ah ya yeah, eba nasema make it african hmm okay 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 itabidi watu wa get into that bug ya ku dig african music karim unasemaje hazel unasemaje make it african make it kenyan make it global what do you think ninyi mta decide and we shall go with that kama kutakuwa na alterations na modifications <laughs> baadaye tutazifanya it's always in a shape shift eh bana sema some of us are not kenya <laughs> niju niju nilisema na nimesema najua tusikizi mziki ya kenya i know najua, maybe ndio maana pia watu na refrain from voting <laughs> Because that was kizi mziki ya Kenya. Ah. Uh, tembea tembea tem, tembea pale kwa sana kwa sana on YouTube tafadhali. Tafadhali I'll put you on. We'll put you on to so many artists. <laughs> ah yeah. <laughs> Kuna make it African ya Abe then Karim anasema Kenyan muhimu global badai. Uh, MK97 says make it african all the way through hidden talents now this is interesting <laughs> uh this is interesting this is interesting ah uh, yeah. then hazel and i suggest kenyan will be a challenge but not impossible i i know hazel is always up for the challenge which 
is an amazing thing but anasema why not why not why not a mix alternating in a pattern that that could that could work and then eba anasema nita ku introduce to libyan rap music gladly you know kuna kuna a time kuna a time i deliberately wanted to search for rap yenye iko in different languages so for instance spanish rap kuna time i, I look into french rap I, I, i really wanted to to do that so hiyo ni really interesting so now you kuna diverse sentiments eba na sama make it african kari matambu ya africa kari manasema kenya muhimu <laughs> kenyan muhimu mk97 anasema to make african so two for african karim 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 wendo wendo patriot peke yako <laughs> kwa hii live leo <laughs> man man eh, kakangu hazel pia anasema kenyan will be a challenge <laughs> but not impossible alafu anasema why not alternate na tuifanye kwa hiyo pattern ya alternate kisha eba msema that introduced to libyan rap music so based on this we can we can we can we can do african kari muko solo wendo the only patriot clearly clearly walk with me through this joke clearly karim is the only patriot here and you know how you can tell besides sentiments zake look at his name karim underscore who so kile tutafanya kile tutafanya ni tunaweza na 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 african music and the idea ni kila wiki tukifanya hizi live streams tukimaliza tunapea na recommendations za african music so tutaanza next week so tutaanza next week na niko excited about it so you, if you are if you are finya your like button finya your heart finya your heart up if you are excited about this now i am looking forward to having you here next week to pay any recommendations zetu sana so finya your heart button if you if you are looking forward to this and we shall be doing this sana and i think what we can do if if people i don't know how we can i'm thinking about so do how we can we can compile these recommendations somewhere iko a sort of a database so do how we can do it but if thank you for for pressing the heart and the like button if there are songs we, we could make playlists together we could make sana kwa sana playlists kila sunday at the end of this if there are songs but if there are album recommendations and we can have a list somewhere of iso albums i'm at the general list ya kila so i suggest so i welcome your ideas kwa inbox after your conversation to do how we can have them somewhere i want them i want us to have iso databases and catalogs mahali so nakaribisha ideas zako on the same i am glad you're looking forward to it me pia niko excited about it so we, we if you do not listen to african music kama we si kakari map na yes the joke landed thank you the joke landed <laughs> to, to you 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 you'll be forced kusikiza african music u utafute watu wa kusikiza u discover mziki alafu ukuje u share hapa na watu that would be exciting i cannot wait for us to have that yes tuanza ku kuunda playlist ni easier for for songs for albums tutajua how to do it lakini we shall have just a list and then we'll find we'll find a way ya ku share naweza share kwa my blog sana kwa sana.wordpress.com and then kama ni a list and then for the playlist to create that to populate kwa different platforms youtube be another option and that has been an amazing an am-
amazing and amazing roundup ya the week alafu tume get into discussions pia za za mziki hapa na pale shukran sana for your time shukran sana for being here and kuchangia haya mazungumzo looking forward to seeing you next week and what was kizem mziki africa sasa and then perhaps maybe a week you know, we will know how we will we'll, we'll do to when kama you following week we'll keep it kenyan and then to alternate we shall we, we could use that pattern one week african one week kenyan that when it to ki change maybe we shall determine that next week i'm at to know how this goes with any mesema it can morph into a number of 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 things um, of ways so looking forward to ku have hapa tena wiki inayokuja shukran sana kwa kuapa mk ali to join tukimaliza na amechangia amesha sentiments zake amekuwa part of the discussion thank you sana karibu this happens kila sunday abe shukran sana for being here kama kawaida hazel asante sana for your time kama kawaida karim shukran sana for your time kama kawaida and i'm glad kwa 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 kukua hapa hadi wiki ijayo tuonane when that time comes asante sana kuwa na usiku mwema if you are a night owl and a nocturnal creature like some of us kuwa na asubuhi njema alafu generally kuwa na wiki njema until we see each other next week kumbuka nimesema kuna reviews that we've done of eight Kenyan music projects that I'm supposed to edit this week and zitakuwa zina come out hivi karibuni feel free to check out the projects na ku, kuzisikiza na ku look forward to hizo reviews until next week shukran sana and just a wrap up ni Victoria Kimani Spirit Animal Noel Deritu City on a Hill Domani Munga exposed to my review mm, Kalen June by Kemboy Majira by Ivy Alexander Anawea ya Matata na Ben Sol and Viri Sichangi soundtrack to a heartbreak alafu lost in motion ya Jaquil all of these projects reviews zao tumezifanya they should be coming out in a few days sana kwa sana pale YouTube sante sana Check yane wiki ijayo. <laughs>